Christmas is coming, and you know what that means? It's more than just gifts. It's about giving back in your own community. We're here today at the St. Catharines Museum for the start of the Mitten Tree Campaign. The Mitten Tree Campaign we've been doing for almost a decade now. So basically what it is, is it's uh, in support of Community Care St. Catharines, Thorold, and Start Me Up Niagara. So every year we collect all these winter woolly garments, especially hats, mittens, um, socks, and then we collect all the donations and then we send them off to these organizations. Very good, and it probably started as just a mitten tree years ago, but as time evolves and people get cold during the holidays, it's, it's changed now. When it first started, it was actually known as the talking mitten tree. Um, unfortunately, we ran into some technical difficulties though, so the talking mitten tree kind of just transformed into the mitten tree. Still had the same message though, with bringing in donations um, for community care organizations where we would just send them out to people in need during this like really harsh wintry season. So even though the tree doesn't necessarily talk, it talks about helping people in the community, I guess you could say. Absolutely. So the mission for the mitten tree is we really just want to encourage compassion, generosity, and just really instill what it means to give back and then getting the community involved with one another. How does this feel to be involved at this type of thing during Christmas? Honestly, I love it. So the holidays are like my favorite time of year and I think it really is important to give back to each other and just continue to instill that focus because it's a really important time and it's a time when family and friends get together and we just need to keep in mind that not everyone is always so fortunate and that giving back can even like a, a pair of mittens, some hats, some socks can be the greatest gift of all for some people. Tell me what it means for the community to help out once again in another fundraiser here for you. It really means everything to us. Uh, without the community's support and people coming out and really making and driving our agency's work, we wouldn't be able to complete half the stuff we get done for the people of this community. Um, and it really brings it home this time of year because it's, you know, the cold weather is coming and the added pressures of trying to bundle up and make sure that you're prepared for everything. And it just means for our families, it's one less thing that they have to worry about. And we know that everyone we deal with is gonna stay safe and warm. And as Christmas approaches, obviously the need is to help out more and more families. Unfortunately, that doesn't go away. The number gets bigger every year. Yeah, at Community Care, we registered over 13,000 St. Catharines and Thorold residents for our Christmas programs alone last year. We're expecting that number to rise this year, unfortunately, but um, it also means that we've had such a great response from the community. So we try to look at the positives mm -hmm. um, and really kind of roll back and say thank you to everyone who's involved. Today is our really big huge mitten tree launch. As you can see we do have a special visit from Santa who managed to come all the way from the North Pole a little early a little bit before Christmas just so he can visit with some families and other visitors and we do have live music so Sarah Bolton is with us. We have a knitting circle going on so we invite um, our experienced knitters, our new knitters to come out so if you don't know how to knit don't worry you're more than welcome to come. Our experienced knitters will show you. We have some crafts going on so we have a museum tradition tree that you can add to so if you have a favorite holiday tradition um, from this holiday or just something like a memory that you loved during this season you can put it together, you can draw it, you can write it out, and you can add it to our tree. We also have a magical mitten ornament going on where you can create this magical mitten ornament and you can either keep it for yourself or again, like the mitten tree, you can give it to somebody you think just needs a little bit of extra holiday spirit. So we're into the holiday season and it is the season of giving. So if you have an extra mitten, an extra hat, an extra something, bring it here, put it on the tree so someone can enjoy it over Christmas. Reporting for The Source, I'm Bob Ho 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 Romeo.